Okay, so now that we have our Ubuntu container up and running, it's been up about a minute according to that, two minutes. Um, so that's just going to be running indefinitely in the background, but you know, we need to be able to access it and do something with it because, you know, what's probably going to happen is that Docker container is going to be um, providing some sort of service. Um, you know, maybe that's our um, database server. Maybe it's um, a proxy server. Maybe it's our API. Maybe it's our website. Um, you know, maybe it's uh, something that doesn't need to be accessed publicly. But anyways, the way to get into that container is we are going to execute a special uh, docker bash command that's going to get us root access into that container while it's running. Um, so we're not, during this process, we're not going to have to turn it off or anything like that. We're just gonna, well, we're just gonna run right into it. Um, super easy to do. Um, we're gonna do docker execute dash it. And all we're gonna do is, this is the container we wanna shell into. So I'm gonna copy the ID, paste it there. And what we wanna run is bash. Um, looks like nothing happened, but notice root at container. And I'm gonna list and boom, that's our Ubuntu server from Docker Hub because this container is running the Ubuntu image that we pulled from Docker Hub. Um, so, you know, like potentially what could be done here? Well, you could stand up a website in this container. You could stand up an API, uh, some sort of service. Um, you could, you know, you could put your whole application in this container and, uh, you know, you might start seeing the power of, uh, of Docker at this point. Um, you know, whereas before you might spin up a, a CentOS server or an Ubuntu server and start, you know, building your app on that server, 